So I was at my girlfriend's house last night, and someone came up with the brilliant idea of giving me a haircut. And that someone being me, we were hanging out, we had a few drinks, yada, 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 uh, three hours later, and Empire. Empire. I'm bald. I'm just a kid who's born each day I grow some more I like exploring and hiding So many things to do Each day is something new I'll share them with you I'm It really doesn't look all that bad I wanted it to be the length that it was for Macbeth But Pete took the razor and just started going at it And He went too short you know, you shouldn't go too short. You should go to a certain length and you should say, do you want to go shorter? You should never jump too, too short. We made the mistake of jumping too, too short last night. And honestly, I mean, it's hair. It's going to grow back. I don't really care, but it's really fuzzy. It's like, it's soft. I feel like, like, I feel like a cub bear's ass right now. I don't even know what that means. Like a little bear cub, you know? Not that I've ever felt the butt of a bear cub. Funny thing is, no one in my family knows that I did this. So I'm going to film their reactions when I walk in the house right now because I just got home. I feel like Brian Cranston from Breaking Bad. I just want to keep saying, my name is Walter White. I want to walk around in my white tidy whiteies and start baking meth in my garage. Actually, no, no. I don't actually want to start baking meth in my garage. Watch, watch Breaking Bad. Walter White does that. He has lung cancer and he shaves his head and he looks like this. Honestly, if I grew out facial hair here and I kept it buzzed like this, I would look like Brian Cranston from, from Breaking Bad. All right. Let's, let's go pop the surprise on Me Familia and see what happens. I'm really interested to see what they say. I think Steven's going to laugh. My mom is going to be pissed. I think Bing is going to think it's funny, and I think Belle's going to think I'm ugly. I think that's what's going to happen. But we'll see. We'll find out. Let's do it. <sighs> the door is locked. Moment of truth. <sighs> do you want to feel it? Oh, I want to go back to bed. Do you think I look ugly? No, I don't care. You want to feel it? No. Dude, come on, try it. This isn't the content that I wanted, Bing. I wanted your honest reaction. What are you giving me? Hmm. This is what Bing and I do in the morning when we wake up. We drink beer and burp. It's your water, bro. Oh my god. What did you do? I shaved my head. Why? Because I wanted to. Why? It's not a good look on you. What are you talking about? Did you do that? Yeah. Did you lose a bet? No. A bear? Nope. Then why? You donate it? No. So, what's the reasoning? I needed a haircut. Why? Do you like the cut? Do you think I look like good? Why are you bald? <laughs> what happened? I've been diagnosed. Shut up. With the coronavirus. <laughs> it's coming for you. Stop. What happened? Um. Where were you? I was gone for 24 hours. 
I came back a new man. You like the cut? Oh my god! <laughs> Why? Why? Why did you do that? Why? Why? Why, Bailey? Why? Oh my god. It doesn't look, it doesn't look that bad, right? In like two weeks, I'll have normal hair again. My hair goes really fast. I was just gonna get the Macbeth buzz cut and then Pete. <laughs> Pete is responsible? No, I mean partially. If we want to talk all responsible, we'd throw in Pete, CC, Mr. Kalarik. <laughs> what made you do that? Uh, well, I wanted to get a haircut. And all the places are closed. And I was like, well, hey, if I bust my head... I'll have a normal haircut in like two weeks because my hair grows super fast. And I've buzzed it from Macbeth before. But the problem is Pete took the razor and took the protector off. So it went down to the lowest setting and he just buzzed it like extremely low. So now it's just fuzzy. Feel it. Feel it. No, feel it. No, feel really... it. It's fuzzy. No, really I feel like I feel like a bear. Oh I feel God. like a fuzzy wuzzy oh, bear. That's all I can say is, oh my god. <laughs> bald now. Going You're gonna fight a bald man, Joey? A man that has been diagnosed with cancer? Bailey's bald now. What's going on? <laughs> What's going on? A man that's been diagnosed with cancer. Joey wants to fight a cancer patient? I think not! What movie is that from, Bing? Bing, what movie is that from? You guys are like, I think not! Incredibles. Uncultured swine. Alright. I'm gonna watch Lord of the Rings now. Please put on the hat. You're scaring me. Mom, it's not that ugly. Mm. It's it's honestly gonna be like Macbeth in like two weeks. It'll Macbeth be like... was bad enough! No, -uh, it's so nice not having any hair. I can take a shower. I don't have to take a shower. Yeah, you need to take a shower. No, care. I don't. It's so nice. It's like... It's like... I can just like wake up and roll out of bed and I don't have to do anything. Oh the hair on my legs is longer than my head now. That's a sad comment. It's comfortable. It's freeing. So as many of you may know, it's April 1st. And April 1st is a day titled April Fool's Day. It's a day where your Uncle Terry comes into the house and throws a firework down under your mom's bed and says, April Fools, your ass just caught on fire. That's something that might happen to you on this day. My joke today was going to be that, pretending that I have cancer, but my mother and my brother have convinced me that that's wrong and that I shouldn't do that. For some reason, I think that cancer jokes are funny, but to each their own. Um, when I post YouTube content and videos, I have to think about my audience and I have to understand that some people might not understand the jokes that I'm trying to hint at, or they might take offense to some of the things that happen on YouTube, because I have to understand the things that people have encountered in the past, like, you know, suicide videos, or, you know, bad stuff that's happened that have left taints and marks on people's careers. So, uh, nonetheless, happy April Fool's Day. I hope you enjoyed the following vi uh, April Fool's, I just burped in your face. I hope you enjoyed the video of my family reacting to me and my bald head. Um, I'm bald now, and don't worry, I don't have cancer. Oh, also, another YouTube video that's happening soon, my mom decided that she's going to play a Fortnite game with me. We're going to do split screen. I'm going to have someone record it, and we're going to be playing next to each other in my room, and I'm going to carry my mom to a Vic Roy, so it's going to be lit. All right, I'll talk to you later. Gotcha. Gotcha. Gotcha.